What's up everyone, Ilya Marchenko here, your favorite tennis YouTuber. Australian Open is in just a couple of weeks, so we are already getting some news about this tournament. Rafa Nadal has been tested positive for COVID-19 after coming back home from the Abu Dhabi tournament, so there is a big question mark right now over his participation at the first major of the year. Dominic Thiem is sick as well after the same tournament in United Arab Emirates, but he claims his test was negative and it's just a cold. But seriously, who gets a regular cold these days? Anyway, he pulled out of the ATP Cup already and his participation in Melbourne is questionable as well. Novak Djokovic hasn't revealed his vaccination status and neither confirmed or denied his participation at the Australian Grand Slam. So from the ATP Tour we have more questions than answers. But what about WTA? Women's Tour never disappoints and doesn't let us down this time as well. Russian star Natalia Vikhlansova has announced on her Twitter that she won't be participating at any tournaments in Australia this year and the reason is rather unique. The vaccine she decided to improvidently use to protect herself and the others from COVID-19 is not verified by Australian government. We are talking about none other than a Russian version of humanity saving tool Sputnik V. Quite an interesting situation, isn't it? What is it? Health precaution or political discrimination? Anyway, I can't resist the privilege that nobody can deny your favorite tennis YouTuber, so let's call Natalia right now and ask her for a comment. Hey, uh, is it Natalia Vichlanceva? Yes. Hey, it's uh, Ilya Marchenko, everyone's favorite tennis YouTuber. Uh, thank you for doing this interview. It means a lot to us. Uh, I know you talk to a lot of people these days. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, so let's start with something general. Uh, you were born in Volgograd, Russia in uh, 1997. Uh, you are right-handed. Uh, two-handed backhand and uh, your career best ranking was uh, 54 in singles in uh, 2017. Is this true? Yes. Fantastic, fantastic. Uh, your recent results were first round in uh, Limonge, uh, losing to Zvera Zvonareva 7-5 in the third, uh, semi-final in Ange. Uh, losing to Vitalia Dyachenko, uh, first round uh, of ITF 100 in Dubai, first round of qualis in uh, Courmayeur, Italy, and uh, first round of qualification in Moscow, losing to Irina Bara 6-2-6-4. Is this true? Yes. Oh, that's awesome, awesome. Uh, in your recent tweet, you said that you were happy with the level of your tennis uh, at the last few events and you wish you could play in Australia, but uh, you were vaccinated by the Russian vaccine against uh, COVID-19 uh, Sputnik V and because it's not verified in Australia yet, uh, unfortunately, you cannot travel to Melbourne and participate in the first Grand Slam of a year. Is this true? Yes. Natalia, you're a legend. It's great talking to you. Uh, great interview. Uh, thank you for your detailed answers. Uh, thank you so much from me and my subscribers. And of course, good luck uh, in your future tournaments. Thanks. Bye. Goodbye. Okay, well, those were the comments from Natalia Vichlanceva on this difficult situation. Great that we were able to reach her and talk to her. But I have another treat for you today. Christmas time, you know. Me, together with my clothing partners from Bidi Badu, have agreed that every month we will be doing a giveaway together. And we will start with this custom-made t-shirt. This is the front and this is the back. It's unique DIY t-shirt. This print was done completely by myself, so it's not without flaws, but still pre exclusive t-shirt. To participate in this giveaway, you need to be subscribed to my YouTube channel and Instagram account and to Bidi Badu's Instagram page as well. To win this beautiful t-shirt, you need to answer one question. You need to guess when and where this picture was taken. Write your answers in the comments below, I will announce the winner in my next video. If nobody answers 100% correctly, I'll choose from the best answers. Peace!